Hello everyone and welcome to Polyfridge 3. My name is Elku and today we are going to dive into the world number 3 called Rustic Barrens. In the previous episode we beat the classic rock and the miner's mountain, both under budget and unbreakable. And I'm going to attempt to keep that streak going through this whole game pre-planned. Some pre-built materials may not be moved or altered, indicated by grayed out joints. Yeah, we saw this in the first episode. We just have this bridge. We have two metal beams and something that I saw on the main menu's bridges, there was a setup like this where there was a metal beam, a rope holding the metal beam in place, and then braces from that. It was just made on the straight bridge, which you can see on the main menu, and not on this bridge, so I'm curious if we can utilize that in this bridge as well. Because that is a cool phrase, I have never tried anything like this. This bridge already looks OK. okay, but there is nothing to brace these because they are too far away from each other. Can I make them closer? No, I cannot. Yeah, we could make like a little X right there. That will brace them. And let's see how this goes. Ooh, that is a cool fire chip. And yep, the ropes were really, really tense and almost breaking, but that was a beautiful bridge. Okay, we might have learned a new brace. That is lovely. Diamond in the rock. No description. Okay, we are just... Oh, okay. They have built a steel brace on the middle. We just need to make a strong bridge, so let's go. We just made it out of wood. Probably not. Yeah, these are heavy, heavy trucks. Damn. Okay, we need to build an absolute unit of a bridge. I will try and save a few bucks by making these middle bars from wood. Not sure if this will hold. Let's see. Ooh, it is actually quite strong. Okay, yeah, this dress is like... 50, 70, Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. okay, yeah, we got this, easy, well tree on the ropes and yet again no description, ah, that is almost like the brace that I learned from the main menu but not even close, interesting, well we are going to utilize this brace as far as we can, is this even stable, no it's not stable at all, okay, yeah because this point can just move down because there is nothing holding it, if we want to to do this, I would need to have ropes right here to hold it in place. Yeah, there we go. And actually, ooh, this dress is super high on the long ropes and the middle is not strong enough. Okay, that's not too bad. We still have a lot of budget to play with. Just going to raise the middle points from there and that should be good, maybe. Or we might need to continue this brace. Ooh, it is orange, but we got this. All right, let's go. Rerouting. Oh, we have this road that we cannot use. So we need to make like a little jump. Actually, could I just use something like this? Like this could be cute. And now we just have to brace this a lot so it doesn't break on us. This is not stable. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what I'm expecting. Like, why do I even expect these things to be stable? Oh, now it's stable. And ooh, OK. I thought we made it, but not quite, not quite. We need to reinforce this side, but that was pretty close. Surprisingly close. If we just put a little brace like this in the there, and yeah, oh, it's fine. All right, that was nice and simple. World 5, faulty foundation. The cars only go in alphabetical order, A and then B. Wait, oh no, don't do this to my brain. We don't have any hydraulics. We have a lot of, lot of budget. Can we move this? No. Okay, we need to get the sheep from here to here and the fire truck from here to here. Oh, 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 this is not hard. I, pff, I have no idea what I was trying to think. I was thinking that we need to have both on the same road somehow. And that was messing with my brain. But we can just do something like this. There we go. That is the jeep's bridge. And then we're just going to make a bridge tall enough so the jeep can go under it. There we go. And now we just need to make this super strong. We'll try to make a similar design that we had in the first episode. A bridge that I absolutely loved. And there we go. We technically have a bridge that should hold, maybe. This seems a bit weird. I'm not sure if this is stable, but we have a lot of budget to play with still. So let's see. At least it's holding. See, the jeep is getting through. Yeah, with no problems. And then... The hard one. The fire truck. Ooh. Absolutely perfect bridge. There we go. Nice. Alright, we got this. 
Under tension. Ooh, we're using cables to have a metal beam on the underside of bridge to brace it. I haven't used a bridge like this before, so this is really cool to learn as well. Just a reminder, I haven't played the poly bridge 1 or the 2 all the way through. I think I'm like in world 2 in poly bridge 2 or something. So I am not advanced at all in this game. And let's see if this will hold. We... Oh no, it's wobbly. Yep. <laughs> I'm sorry, dudes. I'm sorry. I need to brace this in the middle as well. There we go. Now this should be stable. And is it strong enough for two? Yeah, that is a beautiful bridge. There we go. Yeah, I just need to go back to appreciate the maps. Like, I absolutely love all of these. I love the western worlds that they made for this one. Like, every single one of these worlds are so beautiful to look at. And also, it's fun that you can now rotate 360 degrees so you can see the whole map if you want to. Uh, okay. Let's just continue with the game. I just have to appreciate the aesthetics a little bit. Waveform. Wh why? <laughs> Who designed this bridge? Ooh. Okay, I guess we have a minivan with a surfing board on top of it. So they just want to surf on the road as well. Yeah, this is road surfing. Well, we have foundations in this level as well. But yeah, if we do one foundation like that, that is almost all of our budget. So we cannot really use that. I will try and make this without a foundation, I think. Because I don't see why we couldn't. We'll see. We'll see what happens. One thing is for sure, we need to go under brace this time. Because all of the points are on the underside. And we're just going to save money by building it like this. There we go. We have some super crude supports on the underside. Actually, can we afford this foundation over here? If we just start building like a ice cream cone under it or something. Ooh, we are super close using all of our budget. I'm not sure if this will work. Yeah, we are not going to make this under budget if we do this support. Almost. We almost have it under budget. Actually, most stress that we need to negate is right on this point right here, because when the van is going down, it's going to smash into this road. So we need to move this whole thing over to here and just catch it when it's going down. Now we have a support that is ugly as shit, but we are over budget. Damn it. Hmm. We need to make this a little tidier. Let's see if this even holds first. Okay, yeah, it holds it easily, but we are over budget, so we need to fix that. I don't think we need the metal beam over here, and now we would be under budget. Ooh, this stress is pretty high, but there we go. We got it. Nice. Smooth roads. Smooth roads minimize stress on your bridges. Oh, yeah, those are super smooth roads. Yeah, mm-hmm. So, wait a second. Green will just go get the star and then stop over here, so we don't need to even think about the green. Green is doing its own thing. We just need to get the red one from this star to this star and to the flag. So we just need to make a road over here. We copy the design from there. Hmm. I'm not sure if that is a good design for the monster trucks, but we will see what happens to the road. Let's see. Oh, interesting. So the game build bridges. Oh, we don't need to utilize these even. Ah, okay. The game is trying to teach us to fix it into like this shape, but the other one is above us. So it's smoother. I see game. I see. I was just dumb, but there we go. Now the red one should stand. And now I'm super worried about this bridge. Yeah. <laughs> now we have to do the same fixes over here, but we just need to move this one point over and we should be good, right? And yep, there we go. Okay, okay. The game is still teaching us. I see. <laughs> oh, Lee. Lowest stress. 99.82. We could get the leaderboard score right here. Hmm. I might try that actually. So we are just going to delete both of these. We cannot touch that. So we can only change the road or the red one. There we go. Let's see. That bridge was super stressful, but not bad at all. Okay, and we just need to make this bridge a good bridge over here. And this is about stress, so we are going to use metal over here as well. There we go. We are super under budget. We could build this whole bridge out of metal. But lowest stress, 99.82 still. Does this car get it up to 90? Yeah. Okay, so the green car gets it down to 90. So somehow we would need to mitigate the stress from this one. Can we make another road over to here? Like this that is a tiny bit smoother 87 and yep 
I think that worked actually. And now, 92%. We are 48th in the world. Okay, I'm going to make this better. For some reason, I want to make this like a good bridge. There we go. We get to like 69. That would be perfect. Oh, okay, but we go 90 over here. So we need to now fix this bridge. Does that hold? I'm not even sure if this holds at all. Oh, oh no, it doesn't hold. Okay. <laughs> Come on, red one. Do not break the bridge. And there we go. Now we're getting to 69. Come on. Oh, 73 score. But hey, there we go. We are in the top 1% in the world. We are 13th in the world. Okay, that's good enough for me. We are going to go for the next level. Actually, no. Ooh, that might have been actually better. It's this part that is ruining my score. 66.69. We are 7th in the world. Okay, this is the best that I could do in a short time, so this is good enough for me. We are in the top 1% in the world, and we almost have the perfect 69-69%, but... 66.69 is good enough for me. And we are in the top 10 players in the world on the lowest stress, at least. That's something, right? Yeah. Meet me in the middle. No description at all. Okay. The both cars go at the same time. And okay, we just need to get the blue car from left to right, yellow car from right to left. And we're going to use this brace over here. There we go. There we go. I think that is a good support on the underside. <laughs> <laughs> that is the ugliest brace I have ever made, but let's see if that even works. <laughs> oh no, what am I doing to this poor bridge? I'm not even sure if this bridge even wants to stay. Oh. Hey, there we go. Okay. And almost half budget. Dangling roads. No description and what's happening over here? Both cars go at the same time and there is a road in the middle. Why? I am confused by this road. Well, okay. Um, we'll go with this. We need to get the truck on top of this or to here. That shape is nice and symmetrical. Then we cannot do this. Actually, we could. Because if we don't connect this to anything, it is just dangling. And when the car drives and hits it, it will just work as a flap. So this might be fine. Something like this. That is a weird, weird bridge, but we will go with it. As long as it holds, it's a perfectly fine bridge for us. We are not asking anything more than that from our bridge. Here we go. That is actually kind of pretty. And now, how do we brace the underside though? We don't have any ropes, so we cannot build the tension bridge. We can use this point to secure it. If we use this point, then we cannot drive through this. We are going to go with wall braces at least. And hopefully those will brace the underside a lot. This bridge is going to be a disaster. I can feel it already. Not sure if this will hold, but let's see what happens. Oh no, these are red already. Okay, 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 okay. This will be super hard. I think we need to brace this a lot better with the metal braces. Like something like this. Yeah, if we can brace that point and this point on the other side. I'm not sure if our money will allow that. I think it does. Nice. So this will be pretty strong, I think. We just need to brace these to here. And in my mind, this is perfect. <laughs> not perfect, but let's see how this goes. Okay, that was a little bit stronger. We still need to brace this part a lot more and these were super red as well. We can make this bigger, at least. There we go. Bigger triangles equals stronger triangles, right? Okay, that was a tiny bit better again. We are going to make the classic X in the middle. And is that enough? No, it's not. We're going to make another X. <laughs> oh no, we are over budget. Damn, okay. This... Hey, at least the flap works, but yeah, this will be really hard to get under budget. I'm not good enough in this game to be able to make this happen. Like, do we need this thing? Let's see what happens. Okay, well that breaks, but if we brace this into here, there we go. That still breaks, okay. The underside is fine, and we just need to make this bridge stronger somehow. And we do not have a lot of resources to do so, so hmm, we just make it all the way through like this then maybe it is strong enough yeah the top side is not strong enough in any way and we are over budget already again hmm. let's see if i can just make it strong enough Ooh, okay the x's are way to go but then we need to figure out how to make this a lot cheaper so we can get our money back 
Okay, 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 okay. Come on. Ooh, it is so close. We're just going to make this tiny bit larger. Just the tiniest bit. We are 4,000 over our budget. This is not good. Ah, uh, ooh, there we go. Okay, we beat the level, technically. And three sheep. Nice. We didn't do it under budget. So let's see if we can build this thing under here somehow stronger and a lot cheaper something like this it is not holding but we are getting closer we still have four thousand to make this work okay now i'm actually feeling hopeful that we can actually make this under budget the steel beams were super super expensive i just make this super large triangles nope still not it will not break you are not a weak bridge come on now you got this bridge i believe in you let's see nope nope Nope, we are so close to greatness. If we connect this to here, it will just break, right? When the truck goes over it. Or not. Hey! There we go. Let's go. Nice. We got it. Okay. Under budget, unbreaking. We got it. Smooth landing. Okay, we just have a race car that we need to jump from here to here into the finish line and we can only build into here okay this will be nice and fun after the last one at least i think so i think that is too much it will probably go here and jump all the way over to here or something we'll go with this and rope over here ropes over here we don't have too much budget but i think we got this with this bridge already and then a little over brace over to here <laughs> okay we need to make this stable there we go okay i trust in this bridge we have it first try perfect we might still overshoot it a little bit i have no idea how fast this thing will go but let's see come on Ooh, yeah we are overshooting it a little bit but that was super close okay we got this just a little tweak we're just going here and doing it like this now this is perfection look at this let's go super slow motion it's still shooting quite high not as perfect as I wanted, but good enough. Hey, let's go. There we go. Nice. Checkbox. No description. Oh, wait. This is just a simple bridge, right? Am I missing something? Because in my mind, we're just going to make a straight bridge from here to here. The bulldozer will just ram this box, move it around. The star will not go with the box, right? This is one simple bridge. We're not going to use the foundation. We can use the tension bridge that we learned so we can do this and this should be strong enough already almost something like this and we can make tweaks we have so much money i have no idea how heavy this is oh we are going super slow-mo okay let's see our bridge break where does it break from this is almost painfully slow okay yeah it is just crumbling apart bye bye bulldozer <laughs> Okay, we need to make our bridge way stronger. Can I just do this? I think I can. Like, who is going to deny me? This bridge is absolutely perfect. Please, hold. Okay, this dress is not bad. And there we go. Oh, okay, 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 okay. I see. So, this just snapped because the box hit the bulldozer. Does that even help? Let's see. <laughs> I'm not sure if this does anything to our bridge, but... Yeah, it's not. This will be stronger, for sure. That is a lot of metal just holding that point. And, yep, there we go. Next, we have Rolling Start. We have the budget of 55,000. That is a lot. Some cars gain speed going downhill. I believe they do. And, oh, wait a second. We are going to drop B onto this bridge. So we need to make this bridge super, super strong. And that is why we have the foundation, I guess, because we need to brace it from here or something over here there we go and we're just going to make this bulletproof right here where it lands okay and that is 23,000 of our budget already gone Ooh, okay this will be an interesting one also we need to make this jump over to here maybe like this the green car will not be as fast so it will hopefully jump over here and the red one will gain a lot of momentum and jump all the way over to here we're just going to do it like this. there we go okay that might be strong enough for the red car oh the red car doesn't go oh no it's just rolling okay i see i see i think that is strong so now i would just need to make this happen over here maybe like this yeah this seems fine just need to connect this a little bit over here and that might be good the green car goes okay the green car gets so much momentum and just breaks our bridge all right 
we need to make our bridge a lot stronger on this part. We still have 10,000 to play with, so that's fine. We can make a rope right here, and that should be good. Let's see if this in half speed. And yeah, 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 looking good. Okay, perfect, perfect. Anti red one, come on, make me proud. Red one, please. Ooh, okay, our bridge broke, and there we go. Okay. We didn't get it unbreaking. This but a scratch. <laughs> nice Monty Python reference. But hey, that was pretty good. Now we just need to fix the breaking part. AKA this and I think we can just make an X over here and that should be good. Let's see this in full speed. That was beautiful. Boom. Green one goes and red one. Do not break my bridge. There we go! Nice, we got this! And that was the Rustic Barons done! Nice! And we unlocked the new map Serena, Cyclades, Desert Springs and the Radical Meltdown. But these are difficulty level 3 and I was struggling on difficulty level 2 already. So yeah, those worlds will be interesting. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video and if you did, please leave a like and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!